In this video, we're going to be learning how to do the full G chord. Now to do this full G chord, we're going to learn how to play it with the song, The Lion Sleeps Tonight. Now at the end of this video, I'll put the chords and the words up for some of the song so that you can practice. Now with Twinkle Twinkle, we have been using the short G, which is one finger on the bottom of the third fret there. Now we're going to be doing the full G. So I'll put an image up on the screen right there so you can see where I put my finger. So it's ring finger on the bottom, just like we did the short G. Now we're going to be stretching our middle finger all the way up to the low E string at the top here. And our first finger is going to be going on the fifth string, second fret. So match that up with the diagram and you'll have the full G chord. Now to play the song, The Lion Sleeps Tonight, it's quite easy. You know two of these chords already, the D and the A. Each chord is going to be played twice. So we're going to strum twice from the correct string. So for a D, we will be strumming from the fourth string, the D string. Okay, with your pick. So play the D chord, we'll be playing twice. D, D, and then G twice. Then D again twice. And then A twice. For the A chord, we'll strum from the 5th string. For the D chord, we'll strum from the 4th string down. And the G chord will strum all the strings. So the whole song goes... In the jungle, the mighty jungle, the lion sleeps tonight. And it repeats over and over again. In the jungle, the mighty jungle, the lion sleeps tonight. Okay, then you can sing the fun part and everyone can join in and start screaming that And the other bit is a wimbo wet, 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 a wimbo wet. So you can have a lot of fun with that, okay? So three chords. We have done this before with another three chords, A, D, and E. Now we're gonna do it with D, G, and A. Okay, so three different chords, same song. Okay, we'll learn more about that later. So have some fun with that, and I'll see you at the next lesson.